this isn't good. If she looks down and sees the mermaid, she'll freak out. Oh, what do I do? What do I do? Oh, how could I forget about you? Huh? Did I ever tell you how much I like your eyes? Really? Yeah, I love it when they follow me around and don't look anywhere else. Oh, I'll never look away from you. As long as you don't look away from me. Uh. Because if we're going to be in a relationship, you don't look at any other girl, ever. Wait, what? You basically said you only have eyes for me. Uh, I said I like your eyes and how they follow me. Right, but that also means you only have eyes for me as well. This has got to be an equal relationship. Relationship? Yep. Now tell me, should you and I go somewhere alone? Oh, uh, we are alone. No, we're not. I can see that girl lying on the floor over there from behind your shoulder. Wait. What is she doing here? What's on her legs? Oh my! Can you swim? Of course I can! I only needed help earlier because something was pulling me down. Just wanted to make sure. Why? Ah! <laughs> what did you do that for? Wish I was sorry, but I ain't. Fine with me. At this point, I am done with everyone. Why, you? Wait until I get out of here! Seriously, I feel like this woman's dad. Ugh, I better be getting something out of this after all the trouble I've been through. You know, like mermaid treasure or something. Ugh, I need to get her somewhere safe. I, I can't take her back to the boat the way she is right now. I know where I can take her. Ugh, and I have to carry her all the way there. <coughs> Ugh. Huh? There's your way out. Don't follow me. Tell me, how is the kingdom of Mariana these days? Beautiful as ever. Anything change? In terms of what? The way Mariana is? I don't see why anything would need to change. Everything has been perfectly blissful in Mariana. Exactly. It's a beautiful society of people who care about, love, and respect each other. Why would anyone want to leave there? Then why are you here? We came looking for our friend. Why did you leave Mariana? Why did I leave? <laughs> you don't have the time of day. I mean, we don't mind hearing your story. Tell me, have you ever opposed anything in Mariana? What do you mean? Like, had different ideas. Different ambitions. Different views of reality. No? Of course. <sighs> That's why I went in search of something new. And when I found it... I didn't want to let go. I see. A world where everyone thought different. A world where everything would be under my control. Wouldn't that be amazing? Huh? What do you mean? Things in Mariana aren't what they seem. That little bubble you live under? An echo chamber. I understand what you mean. There were a few people who felt like that. What do you mean? A long time ago, in the books of the merfolk. <laughs> that book. That's the book they give everyone. But do you really believe everything it says? No. What? I believe the concepts of the book are best for us to take into account when it comes to making decisions for the people of Mariana. For example, thousands of years ago, humans hunted mermaids almost to extinction. 
And that was because mermaids were taught to trust humans. When the king noticed that mermaids were becoming extinct, he decided to seal them all away. What? I'm surprised. You're actually smart. But that's to be expected from a royal mermaid. We were becoming extinct? Yes. And we still are. Still? I... I never knew this. Royal mermaids are tasked with protecting the people. Tiani, mermaids cannot reproduce if they're not happy. What? The death of Queen Mariana brought grief to everyone. It lasted for generations. Interesting. I must have ticked her off with something I said. She went on a rant there. I need to excuse myself. I want to start working on something to help your scales. Please, enjoy the food. Caitlin, I had no idea you knew so much. Sorry, it's just... I've been taught that Mariana is the way it is because that's the reality of it. Mariana exists for a reason, and I have to protect it. I've just never learned about the outside world. It just makes me wonder why we were never taught this. I'm still learning that too, Tiani. I need to wait for that princess to tone down. She'll never trust me at this rate. If I could transform you, I know you could help me. <laughs> Captain Garth. Yes? Where is my date? Um, she... Uh, uh, Captain, we couldn't find her anywhere. Keep looking. I'm trying to keep Travis distracted for as long as I can. Roger. I'm honestly growing worried about Aphmau. Is she alright? She's fine! She's fine! I worry about how you managed to get such a girl. Honestly, I was expecting you to pull a fast one on me. What do you mean? I thought you'd find a random bar girl, ask her to go in with you on meeting with me, and run off with the money I'd give you, leaving me with a horrible relationship. What? No way! I'd never do that! You don't exactly have the best reputation, Captain Garth. Um, well... Hold it right there! Huh? Prince Travis! I found you at last! Amber? Oh, great! Your mommy! I am not his mom! I am his guard! Same thing! Prince Travis, you're coming with me! No, he's staying here to meet the girl of his dreams! You mean some bar girl you found to go in with you on a deal to do Prince Travis in! Why does no one trust me? Prince Travis, you're coming with me! Why do you know what's best for him? Because I know better than you! Prove it! Your shoe is untied! Hey, I have boots! Ha! You don't even know what kind of shoes you wear. Pathetic. Ha! Prince Travis! Don't worry, you're safe with me. Amber, I'm not going with you. But, but why? Because you know what happens when I finally settle on someone. I'll never have the chance to do it again. But your majesty, you're going through these pirates? I mean, I was supportive of you, but... I've had some time to think about it, and this doesn't seem very prince-like, and- That's exactly it. It isn't supposed to be prince-like. Amber, do you realize that's all I've ever done my entire life? I'm more than just a prince. Uh, of course you are, your majesty, but I- Amber, I want to do this. It's fun, for once. I'm not leaving until I've finished my date. Fine, but I'm staying here with you. Oh no you don't! You just threw me off this ship! No way I'm letting you stay here and- I'm staying, and that's final. I'm okay with that, but you mustn't act like my mother, alright? I do not act like your mother! Don't agree with that pirate! 
<laughs> Whatever you say. Ugh. I do hope that maiden from before is alright. This is the last time I take a job from Gareth. How am I going to get her to turn back into a human? Fire! When she's not wet, she loses the scales. Maybe that'll help. There! Maybe that'll help. Many hours later. What is taking forever? Hey, 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 wake up! There, you're awake. We've got a problem. No, no, not this again! What do you mean, not this again? You're saying you don't but i can understand what you're saying wait oh no D did the potion it must have worn off great just great wait this is great i don't need to listen to you complain to me anymore huh uh, can you understand me? You can? Uh, interesting. But you can't speak? You know, I think I like you better this way. <laughs> now what? Gonna try to attack me? Got me. <laughs> Actually, this is kind of fun. <laughs> Ugh, what is this going on? Weird. Hey! What the? Your potion must have worn off by now. But I see you have a human captured. Not bad for a mermaid. Huh? What do you mean? There were mermaids called Sirens that were able to make humans fall in love with them and kill them. This was a long time ago. Really? Do you even know your own history? I... <sighs> Never mind. Have you gotten the hair yet? I did, but I have to get this human's help to get it back. Then do it. He doesn't understand me. Take this potion, then. It will at least give you the ability to speak with him. Again? But- Just do it! Tavari needs that hair! Did that crab just give her a potion? <sighs> there. You can talk now? I guess. Can you understand me? Yeah. That's for teasing me! Hey! Tavari is running out of pace- I mean, uh, time. You need to get that hair and get back to him now! But I- Is that crab your friend? Aaron, I need you. What? Aaron, I need your hair. Sorry. Ugh. I've been putting up for this for so long, I'm starting to give in to my thoughts. What do you need hair for anyways? There's a merman who needs it to help me get rid of these scales. Why? Don't mermaids look like that? No! We don't have scales normally. They're ugly. I think they look beautiful. R really? Yeah, it looks natural for you. Uh, are you being nice to me? You really are my friend. <sighs> I'm just done with this, you know? Huh? Here, take it. Th thank you. 
That's not enough. We need more. More? The crab says we need more. Uh, the only place you're gonna get hair is going back to the ship, and you're not going there looking like that. <laughs> That's what you think. Here, take this, mermaid. Hey, don't just drink that without asking him what it is. Oh, right. <sighs> it will turn you human again until you hit the water. Now take it! Right. Again? We need to go back and get the rest of the hair. Come on! Wait!